Hey guys and gals, and my fellow Vedsies, welcome back to another day of Veds. Today, I am going to be sharing a bit of a throwback, whatever day I'm uploading this on, as today, I am going to be sharing what my and my friends' first reactions were uh, at that uh, about that D23 Fortnite mini-event presentation thing that happened back in August. Now... I kind of misunderstood what this was. I thought this was just going to be a replay of the Parks panel. That didn't end up being what it was, but I think the announcements are still exciting either way. I think I also misunderstood the Fortnite announcement. Uh, before we also get started, I should also say, if it sounds like I am very tired in the clip you're about to see, yeah, it's because it was like 12.30 at night, and yeah, I was. I oh, he's talking about me. So you probably recognized our in-game live stream that we showed just a second ago. This is a pretty big moment. Right this now, one? Fortnite players from around the world are watching our show from inside the game. The Not quite, because this was like an hour ago, but... More than one million people watching right now. Wait, no, actually, this could be... And you know what? This is just the beginning. To be so much more than that. We're inviting you to play with Disney in completely new ways. So imagine a place where all your favorite Disney characters and worlds, they converge into one connected one. universe. Imagine a place where you can watch, play, even create your own Disney stories. Imagine watch. Imagine turning everything that you love about Disney into a digital playground that you can play 365 days a year. I'm listening. Yeah, we are bringing the full power of Disney We're here to announce Disney to Infinity. Five. To talk more about it, please welcome some of the best storytellers in the world. Jennifer Lee, Pete Docter, Dave Filoni, and wait Kevin Feige. Wait, 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 wait. Kevin Feige. I know him. What? Wait a minute. Is this going to have nothing to do with the parks? No, I don't think so. I think this is live. This is happening right now. Sir. Thank you guys for coming wow. out. Exciting night at G23. Be careful there, Pete. Uh, this better be some something about the parks I was promised. Either way, they're talking about the Fortnite mode, so I mean, I guess pick your poison. This collaboration with Epic Games. Uh, hundreds of millions of our fans have already played with our characters inside of Fortnite. Now we have a great opportunity for new ways to tell stories. Jen, I'm gonna, I'm gonna start with you. How do you see our classic animated characters evolving in this new universe that we're yeah. talking about? Well, Josh, I can tell you that everyone at Disney Animation is so excited about the potential that we see in the collaboration with Epic. And I am especially excited because my daughter lets me watch her play Fortnite, like, for hours. <laughs> Yeah, I'll spare you this little, you know, how do you do fellow kids. But seriously, we can't wait to create new ways for the audience to enjoy their favorite Disney characters and worlds. And now I know that this Disney universe is still in development, but we didn't want to wait to share something with the Fortnite fans, which is why I am so excited that we are bringing Disney animation characters to the game for the first time this okay. fall. This fall. What characters? Okay. Villain. Come on. Uh, okay, villain. Now, now, now you've got me intrigued. Okay. What villains are coming to this game? <laughs> Cruella DeVille, Captain Ooh, Hook, Hook, Maleficent. Maleficent. Give me my boy. Play vile in style. Style. Rail. <laughs> Hell yeah. Wow, Jen, that, cool. that looks it looks pretty amazing. And you're I called right, dibs on the left side. You're gonna have to fight. I'm gonna have to fight you for that. What we're talking about here with nah, we all know your hook. Pete. Congratulations. Congratulations on the success of Inside Out 2. Pete Doc. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Biggest Pixar film. 
he represents Pixar, Feige represents Marvel. They're going to talk about all of the various brand characters coming. Who the fuck from Pixar are they going to... Is it going to be Woody and Buzz? Oh my god, little backlings. If Lightning McQueen is added to this game, I will laugh my ass off. Well, it, it'd just be a car thing. So we can tell I did notice that the villains, the, it wasn't, the concept art wasn't a complete one-to-one. -one. Yeah, it was Fortnite of Hyde. Which... I'm down. I'm down for that. The, le I'm the, the concept uh, art from the website looks amazing. Yeah, that one, that one I think looked the best. That looked the closest. Hook was number two. I'm just not a huge fan of Cruella. I think Cruella's just too easy to do. Just give the black and white hair and like a Dalmatian fur coat, you can call it Cruella. So I am also thrilled to announce the first Pixar characters are coming to Fortnite this fall. And... This one's gonna be interesting. Incredible? Oh! When the suit fits. Okay. Where? Oh, dude, Violet. Bring Violet. I love her. Please. Give me Violet. Edna. Are those like a. Are those the actual okay. models? Okay. Just those three? Oh, come on. <laughs> come on. Also coming soon. All those of looked good. Soon. Those looked good. Like those Yo, looked like it. those looked like the characters. Mrs. Incredible better be kicked up. Better be blowing things up and blasting things. The best thing about this announcement is you're gonna get this stuff next week. No way. What? Wait, what? This is coming next week. No, I have more. Oh, good. Yeah, yeah. IG-11. Oh, he's he's for... The way uh, of the Mandalore. Okay. You are both hunter and prey. Oh! <gasps> oh! This is the way. I'm down. Give me another Grogu. Little, little backpack. Yeah, but he's in a backpack. Look at him! I'm buying the skin if I have to, just to get Grogu. Oh no, buddy. <laughs> August, August 12th? 12th. Dude, that's in like two days. That's literally tomorrow. Well, tomorrow from when I'm recording this, he was already in the game. Never mind. So it was IG 11 from Mandalorian, and I had. I, I, it's too late. I don't know who the second character was. Probably someone from. What was it, like it was like some kind of stormtrooper. And like the red on him. I'm not a Star Wars person. I don't know. In shows like The Mandalorian in our environment, so we're always constantly looking for new ways to really take you, the fans, to our galaxy, and we're working on it. We're really excited about this collaboration with Epic. The Star Wars characters, I would argue, are like. I'm not that interested in hearing about them because we just we have so many of them already. Like, like Disney characters and Pixar, I think, were little ones that to me were like, how are you gonna do that? Like, what are the rules? It's like Jeff Kaplan's distant cousin. Oh, so they're, they're just adding another mission. Okay. Cool. Falcon alongside Mando and Grogu sounds like a Star Wars dream come true. 
And of course, we're gonna use the Unreal Engine to create it, so this whole thing comes, comes full circle. All right, hey, thank you, D23, and may the force be with you. <laughs> yeah, blah, 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 blah. Kevin, oh, I don't know, the last two to me are like... been already mm. huge in, in yeah. Fortnite, yeah. and the response that we've seen, just, just fantastic. It's give give me TVA Loki. So Feige will just give us the trailer, I imagine. Oh, sorry. Infinity War movie. Uh, a few years after that, Galactus came and destroyed the whole island, and some of you... And now, million plus, I said, uh, may have seen that clip. That clip of Galactus destroying the island of Fortnite is so cool. I shared it with the team currently making the Fantastic Four movie to get that spirit of Galactus across. It's incredible what they're able to do. And what mm. else I love, and my 11 year old son who plays Fortnite every day, a lot of people learn <laughs> about our characters for the first time Thanos, Galactus, through Fortnite. So we get a chance sure. that everybody can learn about our heroes and our villains for the first time. And that inspires them to then go look at our comics, go on Disney Plus, go to our movies. So this synergy, really corporate important. synergy. Yeah. yeah. All these people on stage, evil. We've got to have money. Marvel at on Fortnite next week, August 16th. <laughs> and this, well, let's go. <laughs> I like Thanos and Galactus before him. A little bit of a little bit of a iconic villain coming. It is a character you may have heard us speak about over the last couple of weeks. Doctor Doom. Fortnite is Doctor Doom. <laughs> which isn't cool. Which isn't that crazy? Because he's already been in the game, but. Right? Fine. Which but also is actually <laughs> down his face. I'll keep myself in the balls. Yeah, that'd be pretty cool. If he, I swear, if he takes off the mask, I'm gonna lose it. <laughs> oh, DJ. Oh, DJ. Oh. Cap. Oh, oh. Jonesy Cap. Jonesy Cap. Okay, it's a bit lame. Oh, <gasps> what does that mean? Like, Mysterio. Oh, God. Myster Mysterio. The X Men. Yeah, we already knew that. Wolverine yeah. peel. Oh, it's skin. Oh. It's a full skin. Big old castle. Gwenpool. There she was. New mask. Same oh, cast. Oh, stock rifles are back. And I'm assuming that's coming to the... Yeah. Sick. Black Panther. Black Panther. Black Panther. They'll be different. And you can... Oh, we can fly with them this time. Wait, was that? Oh, I, oh, I don't think oh. you, I don't think you could fly with them before. You could, you could so. like, you, you could raise up into the air and hover, but you couldn't fly. Uh, Double war SMGs. machine. They've got Rhodey. Oh, war machine. And, and oh, he's different to Iron Man. Oh my God. Oh, this is gonna be sick. Oh, that's gonna be no, sick. No, look, it's gonna be a sick that. season. I just wanna keep looking at that, dude. Uh. Peely okay. pool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alright, get him, Peel Peelverine. Are you. Are you serious? <laughs> I have to go back and watch some of the stuff. Are you serious? <laughs> Well, dude, they, that was live, and they already, like, they spent, what, an hour and a half actually talking about all the parks and stuff? That's what I was oh, here that's for. What I missed. That's, that's what I was avoiding. Yeah, and like I said, I completely misunderstood the actual Fortnite announcement that did specifically say that this would only be focusing on the Fortnite specific announcements, I guess apart from that one for the uh, Millennium Falcon ride, I guess that one slips through the cracks. I wish it was the whole panel, but I'm still happy with what we got. I'm really excited for what this Disney mode in Fortnite is going to be. I'm always going to be excited for more Disney skins coming to the game because I think they really do a good job and price it rare you know, pretty fairly 
especially compared to other games. <laughs> Overwatch 2. Anyway, uh, that's pretty much all I've got for today, guys. Uh, if you have any ide you know, ideas of what you think the mode could be, if you have any thoughts about anything you've seen, leave them in the comments down below. And until next time, guys, gals, and my fellow Vedsies, I will see you tomorrow.